today I am back to do a very much requested video. I am doing my morning skincare routine. I have filmed my nighttime skincare routine, but that was around a year ago, and things have changed a little bit, but I've never filmed my morning skincare routine, and I've been getting a ton of requests to do that, so I thought I would film that today. But before I get started into my video, I wanted to talk to you about my scarf. I'm in love with this, and I just got sent this by a company called The Moon Cats, and they're um, a New York City company. They're based out of the fashion district, and they just sent me this beautiful scarf, and I'm so in love with it because it's so cold right now, and I'm typically not a leopard print person. Um, you know, I like to keep things very classic, so I don't want anything too loud or that draws too much attention but I absolutely love this one. This one is actually called Wild and Warm, and it's definitely warm, and even though it's a leopard print, like I said, I feel like it's very classic and it's very blended. Um, I don't know, I love the print, I love how it feels. It's very thick. Um, I like them to be long and thick. I want to be able to put a scarf on and feel like I have like a cozy pillow, you know, on this area just protecting my chest, and that's that's exactly how it feels um, and it's long enough and wide enough that you can do different styles I'm just pretty boring with that and I just do the regular you know wrap it around and do it like this but you can definitely if you're good with scarves you can definitely do a lot with this because they're wide um, they also sent me a handwritten uh, letter not letter card that says dear Kristen I hope you will love your new wild and warm scarf thank you from the moon cats that looks like this and I thought that was super sweet also, they were kind enough to provide a coupon code for all of you. So if you're interested in looking at their website, um, this one's really beautiful, I think. But they have infinity scarves. They have um, even, what do you call those? I don't know. Is it beanie hats? I don't know. The ones that, like the bows that go on your head to kind of protect your forehead. They have all different types of um, scarves and things like that that I think you would like and I will leave a coupon code down below or somewhere in the video. So yeah, right, so back to the video. If you're interested in finding out what my morning skincare routine is, just go ahead and keep watching. Good morning guys. So step one of my cleansing routine is to just rinse my face with cold water just to give me that awake look. And typically I will not use a cleanser in the morning just because I don't feel like my face is dirty and I have such an extensive nighttime skincare routine. But for some reason, if I do, I will just use this Mad Hippie one which is a super gentle cream cleanser. Now step two is to tone my face and I use this Andalou Naturals Clementine Plus C Illuminating Toner. This is super easy because all you need to do is spritz it on your face. This will not only tone your face but it will also help brighten up your skin tone because of the vitamin C. And speaking of vitamin C, I've been applying this vitamin C serum every single morning. All I do is apply three to four drops onto my face and then rub it in gently with my fingers. This will help with hyperpigmentation or any dark spots that you might have and it will also help stimulate the collagen production which decreases with age but definitely prevents wrinkles from showing up. Now onto moisturizer, I've been using this Age Define Daily Defense Moisturizer for a very long time. Now it's very lightweight but it does moisturize your skin very well. The only thing, and I've said this before, that I don't like is that the SPF is very low so I do need to apply a stronger SPF before I leave the house. Alright, so now on to eye cream. I've been applying this one by skin every single morning and actually I also use it at night. And it's a very rich and moisturizing formula. And this is pretty much what I've been looking in an eye cream. Something that is very gentle and moisturizing, but has more of a creamy formula versus a gel formula. And I've really been enjoying this one. So like I said, my morning moisturizer only has 18 SPF, and I've been recently advised to keep it at 30 by a skincare specialist. Pretty much, if you go anything higher than 30, it starts becoming more of a chemical SPF, which will be a lot harsher on your skin. And since my skin is on the thinner side and dry side, she advised me to keep it at 30. And I've been really enjoying this natural one by Glow Naturals. And I only apply this in the morning, of course. 
but it's very moisturizing as well and it dries up and gets absorbed into my skin very quickly, which I really like. And also, don't forget your neck. And last but not least, moisturizing your lips is especially important in the winter time because the weather is so drying. And I've been enjoying this one by EOS Lip Balm in Strawberry, which is made out of 98% organic and natural ingredients. All right, so that was it for my morning skincare routine. I really hope you enjoyed it. Comment down below, let me know if you wanna see an updated version of my nighttime skincare routine because it has been a year. Um, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like the video. If you're watching this and you're not subscribed, don't forget to subscribe for more videos. This way you get notifications every time I upload a video, which is typically on Wednesdays and Fridays. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching. Thanks for supporting and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye guys.